minor in the psychology and like my favorite type of psychology is like psychological so that doesn't make sense because psycholo psychology is all psychological so hmm. I actually have like It's your girl Jay and today I'm here with my most anticipated releases for March 2020. We're about like halfway through March now so we're a little late with the video. But I have five total that I want to talk about. I tried to choose ones that aren't super duper popular because ain't nobody got time to listen to the same five books over and over again. So without further ado, let us get started. The first book that I have, I actually have a physical copy of because the publisher sent me an ARC and it is Darling Rose Gold by Stephanie Warble. This is to be released March 17th, 2020. Gabby from Gabby Reads and Jacqueline from We Be Bookin' have talked about this on their channel and they say that's one of their new favorite thrillers. Like apparently it's really good. I'm super duper excited for it because your girl loves herself some thrillers. But this book follows a girl named Rose Gold Watts and for the first 18 years of her life she has been told that she is sick but no doctor is able to tell her why she is sick. She discovers that her mom Patty has been lying to everybody and that causes her mom to go to jail for five years. She is released from jail and she begs Rose Gold to let her back into her life. Everybody is surprised when Rose Gold says yes but Rose Gold is out for some revenge and it's like the story of that. I think it's supposed to be similar to the Gypsy Rose, I think that was her name, case where her mom like pretended she was sick. It's like a mental disorder. I don't remember what it's called right now. Yo girl, it's blanking, but I'm really excited for this one. I think that it sounds really good and I trust Gabby and Jacqueline's opinion, so really into this one. The next book that I have on my list is called My Dark Vanessa by Kate Russell and this is to be released March 10th, 2020. This is another one that a lot of people on booktube have been talking about. A lot of people got the arc and read it and said it was really good. It's like the psychological relationship between a student and a teacher. It follows a girl named Vanessa who when she was 15 entered a relationship with her 42 year old teacher. Years later she is contacted by another student who says that they were sexually abused by the same teacher. So now Vanessa needs to decide whether or not she is going to stay quiet or redefine herself and her past experiences and it's like the psychological relationship. I just personally think that books like these that explore psychological relationships with things is really interesting. I actually have like a minor in psychology so I just find anything to do with psychology really interesting so I'm just really excited for this one. I think it sounds really good. The next book that I have on my list is called All Your Twisted Secrets. This is by Diana Urban and this is to be released March 17th, 2020. It follows six high school students who are invited to a scholarship dinner. When they arrive there they discover that the room is locked and they are told that they are stuck in the room with a bomb and a syringe of poison and they need to decide who is going to die or else all of them die. And it's the story of them trying to figure out who is behind this dinner and as time goes on more and more secrets come to light and they realize that they are all hiding something and I just think that it sounds really interesting. I'm definitely intrigued to know what the secrets are. I want to know if they're going to decide who needs to die or not or if they're going to like come up with some way to get them all out. I don't know. I'm here for it. I'm really excited. The next book on my list is called The Return. It's by Rachel Harrison and this is to be released March 24th, 2020. It follows a girl named Julie who disappears. Her best friend Elise knows that she is going to return. Two years later to the day that Julie disappeared, she returns but she has no memory or recollection of what happened to her and it's basically the story of people trying to figure it out, I guess. I was very excited about this. I think that it sounds really interesting, but Julie from Pages and Pens just put up like a vlog type wrap up video where she talks about this book and she said it really wasn't very good, but your girl's still gonna read it and hope for the best because I usually like books that people don't like, so. We'll see what we think of it. The next book on my list is called The Eighth Girl. This is by Maxine May Fung Choi. This is to be released March 17th, 2020. The book follows a girl named Alexa who has multiple personalities. Nobody is aware of these personalities except for her therapist, her stepmother, and her best friend Ella. Ella ends up getting a job at a 
high-end gentleman's club and quickly draws the attention from the owner and he brings her into his inner circle. One night Alexa joins them and she becomes aware of a terrible secret. That's when she needs to follow Ella on a rescue mission and she needs to discover whether her multiple personalities are her greatest asset or her greatest weakness and it's like the story of that. I just really like books about mental health, mental disorders. I'm assuming that this girl has DID or multiple personality disorder, dissociative identity disorder, whatever you want to call it. I don't know if that's actually true or if it's something completely different but I'm very excited for this book. I think it sounds really good. So is on my list. Alright everybody, so right. those were the five books I am most excited about for March. Let me know down below a couple of books that you are excited about or if you, by the time you see this video these books are out. If you've read them, what you thought of them, let me know and I'll see you all in my next video. Goodbye!